All right, welcome back to a brand new video of the Targeted Individual Program, Targeted Individual Experience. So, again, the New York Federal Department is engaging in, again, remote no monitoring. Well, got up, went to go brush my teeth, went back into my bedroom as I'm looking at my blanket, and they start using the sirens. Get very low again, right? Now, I was talking about this, how they'll, they'll try to intimidate me. They'll try to, they'll engage in, in the psychological blitz, right? Which means it's a very intense form of uh, psychological operation, psychological warfare, okay? And then when I expose them, they go back to being very, very subtle. Right, even more so, even more subtle than other than at uh, uh, most times. So, yeah, how do I know that I'm on the being remote no monitoring? Right, it happens the most inside of the house whenever I, I go and brush my teeth. Okay, how I hold my two two brush where I place my pointing finger. All right, will, and again, the color of my toothbrush is, uh, and again, it's the color, right? So it's white and gray. So usually if I'm brushing my teeth and I'm uh, holding my toothbrush with my, you know, palm of my hand and then my pointing finger is on the gray color of that toothbrush, it will use a siren. And they'll do it so much, sometimes I, I just close my eyes. And if I close my eyes, they would, uh, Again, use the sirens, <laughs> right? <clears throat> so that's how they engage in, you know, these this sort of noise campaign, right? And on top of that, happy monitoring. Basically, no privacy in my own thoughts and in my own mind, right? Next, and every time I enter into my bedroom, and every time I uh, stare at my blanket, which is again the color green, I talk about every time I hold that color green in my hand or look at the color green, they will engage in an extreme form of noise campaign due to the little monitor, the new car. DPL 4132. Again, it's not a new new car, but never seen it before. And again, number 32. So lately, again, large uh, uh, increased showing of vehicles with number 32. Right? Uh, do the cross the street there. Yeah. As soon as he sees me touching him, look, look at him over there. <laughs> as soon as he sees me, start touching his head. Okay. Look at him, look at him. Okay, he's perched. Let's stand up in the corner, stand up on the sidewalk, wait him. Right? It's basically stalking by people in your community, uh, people who they bring into the community. But, um, you know, you don't know them, and what they'll do, sometimes they'll use the same person, but once you start to expose them, you no longer see that person, and they'll use somebody else, all right? It's all part of the, you know, <laughs> the tactics. So when you say, hey, these, these, these people are stalking me, you know, and you're trying to explain it, you know, without knowing about coercive persuasion programming, Right, about certain programs like Just to Zoom in East Germany at the time. Right, but I understand that a lot of these tactics also were created by the, a lot of these soccer tactics were created by the, the, the uh, KKK. Right, All right, the KKK, at least in its, in its, its founding uh, members, you know. They were 
heavily involved in, you know, what they call, what they call, uh, occult knowledge. All right. So, again, we're not dealing with just talking about the dark, tri regular people dealing with dark triads, people who have a dark personality and are in positions of power. Right? As I said, position, you know, you know, um, the sorry. Right? So, like I said, whenever you, whenever, if you're a TI and there's certain words, and it's basically certain words, and then, uh, whether you're saying a word that belongs with that has a, a letter, certain letters, right? That they will engage in this sort of uh, targeting, right? Okay? So you gotta understand what it is that they're doing. Right? How they're programmed you. And you're programmed. If you're a TI and these things are happening to you, not only. Or they, if you're probably microchip, but hopefully, uh, hopefully, hold, hold hold Steve, they just little, you know, and they'll dress them up a little nicer. You can tell. Right? So, um, yeah, that's what I said. Um, yeah, if you're a TI, you're either you're, you're microchip, right? But you're also programmed. They, yeah, I've heard the problem grab them up. They um they program, right? Basically they 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 break into your psyche, they manipulate your mind, your subconscious mind. And so like I said, if, if you don't have that awareness to realize what's going on and, and at, in the beginning, you know, who knows what they've done to you or what they have and, and how they entrap you. Right? That's what they do. Talk about the the mental destruction destructive programming, which is called mental side. Right? The people or an individual is are deliberately manipulated in a negative way using psychology and psychiatry. Right? Your our minds are programmed Thinking, be, uh, to thinking, believing, and then uh, behaving negatively, right? And you don't know because you know you are your mind. So if somebody program your mind negatively, you're going to act negatively, right? That's what meant, meant to side is. Go we'll look up the term meant to side. All right. And yeah, I'll talk to you guys in this video.